this video, I'm going to show you how to find the integral of cosine squared of x. This is a very similar method for the integral of sine squared of x. So what we do first is we look at the addition formula for cosine of 2x. And this equals cosine squared of x minus sine squared of x. And we also know the identity sine squared of x plus cosine squared of x equals 1. So we want to substitute sine squared of x here into this identity. So rearrange the sine squared of x. This gives us 1 minus cosine squared of x. And we want to substitute this here, right here. So if we bring this down here, cosine 2 of x equals cosine squared of x minus 1 minus cosine squared of x. So let's expand this out. Cosine squared of x minus 1 plus, because it's double negative, plus cosine squared of x. So this equals 2 cos squared of x minus 1. So now we want to rearrange for cos squared so we can substitute it here. So 2 cos squared of x equals, if we bring the 1 onto this side, get cos 2x plus 1. And divide both sides by 2, get cos squared of x equals cos 2x over 2 plus a half. So let's go ahead and substitute this in here. So this equals integral of cosine of 2x over 2 plus a half dx. So the integral of cosine of 2x is sine of 2x. And this will be over 2, but just like the sine squared integral, we have to compensate for the 2x here. So we have to use the reverse chain rule and multiply it by a half. And the integral of a half is just x over 2 plus c. So this gives us sine 2x over 4 plus x over 2 plus c. So there you go, the integral for cos squared of x.